This is the scene. A dog left inside of a car in the sweltering heat. Even though 90 degrees may not seem hot to some people, inside of a car... The heat will get trapped inside of the car. And the heat doesn't have anywhere to go, and so it, it can be very, very quick. To show just how fast temperatures can rise inside of a car to make a deadly scenario for an animal, we're going to use this thermometer. It reads about 98 degrees. We're going to put it in this trunk and give it about 10 minutes. Now that the time is up, our thermometer is about 110 degrees. The veterinarians say that dogs pant to cool themselves off, but when a car is this hot, their panting doesn't work, which can lead to a deadly situation extremely quickly. It starts off with uh, affecting the heart and lungs, and then as the temp their body temperature rises, they can go into shock, and that can lead eventually to death. And the dog's already not looking great. I mean, he starts getting less responsive and less active or her, him or her, from the vehicle. Looks like my owner's right here. Some people might think that having the windows cracked is enough, but that's simply not the case. She's only getting here about 15 minutes by herself. But even if you're going into a store for a few minutes, and even if the windows are cracked, the temperature can still rise pretty quickly. This was an emergency, but it was an emergency. I think it'd be possible for you guys. It was in her, so I didn't know.